we had just uh, received a brand new catcher's mitt, uh, which had been cured uh, and made ready to go. Uh, first game uh, that I remember behind the plate, uh, Nolan was in his usual form uh, and his fastball uh, as fast as usual, moving uh, quite well. It would hit the glove, pop out, and uh, and and look like. I did not know what I was doing uh, behind the plate. So I, I walked out the mound and I said, you're making me look like an idiot. We've got to do something different here. There was an old black catcher's mitt that had about a quarter of an inch tear uh, in it uh, that uh, was almost like a softball catcher's mitt for people who played softball. Uh, <clears throat> and I put this thing on, was able to handle it uh, where we looked like we knew how to play baseball. And after the uh, year was up, uh, that quarter inch tear had gotten to a half inch tear, inch and a half tear, to the point that I was having to wear a piece of uh, foam rubber uh, in order to be able to stand the impact uh, of the ball. And even then, it was so bad that my left hand would swell to the point when it was my turn to bat, I had to uh, put my index finger down the bat and hold it almost like a golf club uh, to, to hit the ball uh, and even finish uh, the game. You can see how fast a fastball can come from Nolan. And it does not slow down uh, until the game is over. So when you're pounded that hard, <clears throat> that's what happens to an old white catcher's mitt.